Hello and welcome again to BKTV Fitness with George. Um, I heard some really good things about um, you guys at home last week, taking part and joining in with me. Um, so I'm really excited to be here again to share this another episode with you. Um, if this is your first time, then not to worry. Uh, basically how it, how it works is I'm just going to deliver some nice, easy, fun, simple ways for us to get active, do a bit of exercise whilst we're at home, just to make us feel a bit more happy and healthy at the start of our days. Okay, so same as last time, but we're going to do a few different ones this time. So we're going to start off with some stretches. Now stretching is really important when it comes to doing exercise, just in case you pull any muscles. So we're going to get our muscles nice and warm and ready to go. We're going to start off with our arms today. Now it's a different one. So arms nice and straight. And if you put your left arm, so you can put your left arm up, that's it. And then with your left arm, you're going to put it across your body. And with your right arm down here, you're going to tuck it underneath and hold your shoulder. And you're going to hold it there for a good five seconds. And you should feel a nice slight pull here, you can feel it stretching and we're going to swap over, so right arm now is going across your body and the left arm is coming underneath to hold the shoulder and once again you'll feel it on this side nice stretch ok, give that a little shake out now still on the arms, what we're going to do this time is if you put your left arm up in the air and if you bend it down as if you're now going to touch the back of your head. So you should be touching the back of your head. So your elbow should be up there like this. And with your right arm, you're just gonna reach over your head, hold your elbow, and just give it a slight pull, not too hard, just a slight little push down, just so you can feel a nice stretch here. Hold that for five seconds and then swap arms. So again, right arm up, arm touching the back of the head, and with the left arm now, you'll come up, get the elbow, and just give it a nice slight pull so you can feel it on this side now. Okay, give them a shake. Now, um, let's do a few, a couple of leg ones. So what we're gonna do is, let's just see if you can bend down and touch your toes. So keep those legs nice and straight against each other. Arms out in front, and you're just gonna do a nice bend and see how far you can reach. Can you reach your toes? Now most people can't, but if you can, it means you're very flexible. So keep trying, don't push too hard, but just a nice little stretch. And let's see now if you can do it by crossing your legs over. Because you put one leg over the front of the other and I'm gonna bend down and just give it a nice stretch. You should feel it right at the back of your legs here. And you swap leg. So put your right leg over the front of the left, bend down, try to touch your toes, you feel a nice stretch at the back. Now we should be ready to go. Are you ready to get started? Excellent, okay, let's do this. So the same as before, we're gonna do um, five nice easy exercises which you can follow along with me at home, okay? And we're gonna do each one for 10 seconds, okay? So we're gonna start off with everyone's favorite. We've done it last week. It's my favourite as well, that's the star jump, because it's a nice, easy way to get us our whole bodies moving, in case we're going to do 10 big star jumps, okay, all together. It'll be good if you can count yourselves in while you do it, okay, so make sure you've got enough room at home, feet together, arms straight, and we're going to count ourselves 10 big star jumps. Are you ready? On your marks, get set, go. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Well done. Give it a shake. Give it a shake. Now we're gonna have a little rest in between each exercise. It's important that we have a little, have a little rest. Get our breath back. Okay. If you need to have a little drink of water, please do so. Okay. So that's the first one. Now the second one. What we're gonna do is we're gonna get our knees up nice and high. Okay. So we're gonna be doing, we're gonna be doing a march. What we're gonna do is we're gonna get our elbows to touch opposite knee okay so that's your right arm is going to touch your left knee and your left arm elbow is going to touch your right knee so just coming across like this and we're going to do this for 10 seconds as well okay are you ready so on the spot nice big march to see your legs getting up really high are you ready 
Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Well done. Okay, that's two done already. Already I'm feeling my, my heart's pumping. I'm full of energy and I hope that you're feeling the same as well at home. Okay, we've got three more left. Now this one, this is a quite a tough one. It's called the squat. Okay, so what you're going to do is so I'll turn to the side to show you. Okay, so it's basically like you're sitting down on a chair. All right, but have your legs nice and straight. A little bit of a gap in between your feet. Okay, not too much, but a nice little one. And you put your arms in front of you, nice and straight, and then you, you bend to sit. Now we're going to do this, but we're going to do it like a clock. Okay, so we're going to work our way around in a full circle. So we're going to start this way, one squat and up. Then we're going to turn to the front, one squat and up, and then we'll turn to the right and go around. Okay, you ready to follow? So we'll start straight, and we're going to do 10. Are you ready? So arms right in front of you, nice and straight, and you're going to pretend to sit on that chair. Then we're going to go one, up, to the right, two, backwards, three, turn again, four, keep that back nice and straight as well, five, and we turn again, six, keep going, now we're nearly there, seven, turn again, eight, nine, and one more, ten, well done, okay, give yourself a little shake out, and have a little rest, okay, we've got two more to do, now this next one, I think you'll enjoy, okay, so what we're going to do is jogging on the spot, and with your arms, we're going to do just some punches in front of us, nice and straight, okay, make sure you've got enough room to do this, okay, we're going to do this really fast, so jogging on the spot, nice and quick toes, okay, and then we're going to use our arms, Nice and straight, make sure you punch straight and not down and not up. Okay, we're going to put right in front of you. I'm going to do this for 10 seconds as fast as we can. Okay, are you ready? On your marks, get set, go. So jog on the spot and punch in front of you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, well done. Give it a shake off. And we've got, should we do one more? Okay, let's do one more. Uh, this last one is quite tough, but I'm sure you can join me, get it done, and then we're finished. And then we can enjoy the rest of our day. Okay, and this one's called the frog jump. Because how it's gonna work, so we're gonna bend down, touch the floor with our hands, and then we're gonna do a big jump up in the air like a frog. Okay, let's see how high you can jump. Can you jump higher than me? Are you ready? Last one now, nearly finished. Keep going. On your marks, get set, let's go. 10 frog jumps. Bend down, touch the floor. One, two, three, four, five, six. Nearly there, keep going. Seven, eight, few more. Nine, last one. 10. Well done, guys. Give yourself a clap. Well done for taking part. And I look forward to seeing you again on the next episode, okay? Take care.